about network and that's right. all on the same page in terms of network right, right. Yeah. and when I discovered that the auto museum took away the public easement I realized I had to change that network because it's now no longer safe and they can't encroach on the green belt so yeah, I had to improve it and the city will well like, yeah they have the to mayor, move their fence back so <laughs> the mayor is heard you yeah, yeah. And what she, if, if, oh, if that's why saying, you started talking me, to me. Let me finish. No, I've been talking to her for a long, long time. <laughs> no, no, time. no, but recently. No, not recently at all. Okay, okay. Because she wanted me seven. to give her a tour. Uh, oh, she did? Yes. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. And what did you say? Yes. Oh, nice. On Thursday, next week, 5.30. What do you mean? That's when we're walking the street with the mayor. So, so... That's when she wants to do it. Yeah. So that's not you, why you, I've been talking to her. You knew that I talked to her. No, I didn't. I had no idea. Yeah, she invited me. She On Thursday for Thursday next week at 5 30? Oh, she didn't give me a time. I've been trying to reach her to find out when she wanted to do it. She worked it out with me this week. So ah, that's okay. when we're doing it. Alright. So the what we gotta get on the on the same page with is a network plan. She wants us to be Timba to be on the same page with you. Right. So we need to we need to come to a consensus about it, about downtown network. And okay. the more the better in terms of a green plan. Right. And then then I can get and she will put Center Street Virginia Street and Sierra on the agenda for the council. I think we're breaking the law right now. <laughs> no, we literally are. You have to stop. Have you ever counted how many cars don't stop at stop signs? I have absolutely agree. That's yeah. how come I had the confrontation with a so-called cyclist when he said that I was in the middle of the I road. I break a significant amount of road laws. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, that's one of the paths I want to create. We just passed it. It goes along the freeway all the way to Keystone. Sorry. There is an existing pedestrian path that we just passed. If we widen it by five feet and we continue it all the way down to Keystone, we have a direct path from UNR over to Rayleigh's. That's on my plan. It's, in other words, most of my plan has nothing to do with taking up road space at all. In fact, uh -huh. I'm, I'm avoiding it at every cost. Yeah, I think we're, that's great. Right here, I'm showing you because we can explain, I, we're literally where we're going to meet at. Yeah. Right here, this is where the path would be, on the side, both ways. Uh -huh. And then, when it gets over here, when it gets over here, it goes on this sidewalk. It goes right here. See Kai, this is a bike path. We only have to make it legal. In 1997, there was an ordinance that prohibited sidewalk walking or biking in the city.
the path that they made there is already wide enough. They don't even have to change anything. Yeah, I think we should go with what the, the Dutch design. That's exactly what they do. It's on the right side of the road. Yes. Well, no, no. It's either. <laughs> they sometimes they have two-way paths on both no, sides. I'm talking about the one that's in the Dutch cycling embassy report. They don't. They, they were not making any official recommendations, Kai. On that one, we did. Kai. On that. <laughs> It's an official recommendation in the report on that street. They told us when we were doing the, the workshop. Yes, but who came up with it? We did. They came. They were showing ideas. Yes, I know. And it's in the report. But Evans is the place, not the design. No, the design is in there. Yes, but which of the groups? So okay, there were multiple groups. There. And they all came up with different yeah. ideas. Yeah, so read the report, you'll see which group. I did. Okay, so why are you asking? Because it doesn't say what you're saying. It does. What's that? So it's saying that you can't have a shared use path on it. That says you can't, it's on the right side of the road. I'm not so sad. When you say the right side of the road, it's a two way path with a line going down the middle on the sidewalk. Yeah. It says that we can't do that. It's not, it's All right, we're rolling. You should read it. It's really cool. I it's did. Really, really cool Hi, story. it's been on your website for a long time. I know. You should read it. I did. Okay. Maybe you need to read it again. What I saw were the different maps that the different work groups were creating. Yeah. Use path. It's oh, the simplest yeah. route. At least we, uh, <laughs> yeah, for some reason Kai doesn't yeah, want to. I, don't know why. I figure if anyone has, we need to. It's so much easier. I don't think he understands. I really don't. <laughs> and I've got. I can kick out. I can kick. I'm not using electricity right now, but I can kick that on if I want. Daylight, does that mean a space between vehicles? No, I, I'm, I'm, I'm curious. I've never heard that. That's headway. Headway is what he's talking about. Right, got it. Headway, okay.
Are we turning here? Yeah, we're turning here. Okay. I thought we were supposed to follow the law. Revised statute says that bikes cannot be more than two abreast per lane. So we're breaking the law this entire time. Oh, I, I had to teach. I had to show the Sparks police why they were wrong about why I couldn't be on Whitakins. Oh man, you wouldn't believe the stuff, the the, the car-centric things that are hidden in the source code of our society. We can go anywhere. People don't realize we're amphibians. We can go anywhere we want. No, we can go straight. We can go straight. We can go straight. Well. How upright you are is amazing. It feels like I'm sitting in an office chair. Yeah, that's amazing. This is a Dutch bike. This is what they use for commuting. The reason why this one has an extra uh, brace on it is because I'm fat. That's pretty much what it is. It can support up to 330 pounds. So, so this, well, this extra support? What's the extra yes. support? It's, it's from here yeah. to the rear wheel. It's basically you. an extra truss that provides more stability well, for the frame. That's huge. Cause that's awesome. Yeah. But yeah, no night and day. I used to have an American style bike. Do you, do you feel f uh, flex in the frame? No, that, that's what this does. Uh, well, before or without that though? Um, <laughs> yeah, oh, so it, they, they kind of, they kind of, uh, yeah, I'll just go right through those road cones. Uh, I, 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 I forgot her name, but she came by at the last minute and told me that they were up there. I'm like, oh.
One minute later.
and they call this a bike trail hey, and they honk at us. How are you doing? Good. Beautiful day. Yes, it is.